hear the word of the Lord from Evangelist Eaton Grant. the Spirit of God who certainly is in our midst. Amen. And I want to greet your very fine pastor and bishop. Amen. Bishop Don. Bishop S.A. Don. Amen. I had the honor and the privilege of meeting him some four years ago and he has left an endowed impression on me. Um, amen. And so uh, it, it was month, with, with much, amen, um, gratitude. I feel honored, amen, to be back in Gibson Road, amen, certainly to Bishop Wright and to Elder McLean and all of the elders here, amen, Minister um, Raz, Jazz, I'm sorry, amen, it's uh, certainly good to see you, um, thank you, uh, Mommy Evans, amen, that has been cooking for us all week, and certainly to, amen, amen, certainly to Mother Dunn, amen, in her, in her absence, amen, just a wonderful, uh, the woman of God and just awesome. I love being around here, amen. I, I, while I was here, amen, uh, let me give you a secret young folks, I just kept on trying to pick Bishop's brain, amen, you know, how did you make it? How did you stay married for 30, or for over 50 years? I've only been married for three years, and I don't believe you have to reinvent the wheel, amen. I don't believe you have to go out and try to do it on your own when there are men, amen, that are around that can just download. Amen. And that's what Elisha saw in Elijah. Elisha didn't think or feel like he needed to go on on a 40-day fast. He just figured, amen, if I can stay close enough to Elijah, amen, something's going to rub off. Amen. There is an anointing. There is an anointing by association. Amen. And that's why I'm here. We had the privilege, as Bishop Wright said, to come over with Dr. Colley. Amen. Certainly an anointed man of God. And, 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 and things are rubbing off. Amen. Things are rubbing off. Amen. I believe the last time I was here, amen, I, I, I've gotten a from him, amen. I, I've kind of outgrown it a little bit, amen. But uh, he gave me, amen. He gave me my first role, amen. You may be seated, amen. And now we're reading your hearing, thank you. Uh, and so it's just awesome, it's just awesome to be in the presence of God. And uh, we're not going to be long, amen. Let's read, let's read from Exodus chapter 33, and uh. Just a couple of verses in this chapter here, at verse 18. And he said, at verse 18, have you found it? And he said, I will read in your hearing. And he said, I beseech thee, show me thy glory. This is Moses speaking. And he said, I will make all my goodness pass before thee. And I will proclaim the name of the Lord before thee. And will be gracious to whom I will be gracious. And will show mercy on whom I will show mercy. And in verse 21, the Lord said, Behold, there is a place by me. Thou shalt stand upon a rock. And it shall come to pass, while my glory passeth by, that I will put thee in a cleft of the rock. And will cover thee with my hand while I pass by. And over in chapter 34, Verse 29 of chapter 34, Bible says, It came to pass when Moses came down from Mount Sinai with the two tables of testimony in Moses' hand. When he came down from the mount, that Moses wished not that the skin of his face shone while he talked with him. And when Aaron and all the children of Israel saw Moses, behold, the skin of his face shone and they were afraid to come nigh. Amen. In verse 32, and after all, afterward all the children of Israel came nigh, and he gave them the commandment, all that the Lord had spoken with him in Mount Sinai. And until Moses had done speaking with them, he put a veil on his face. But when Moses went in before the Lord to speak with them, he took the veil off until he came out. And he came out and spake unto the children of Israel that which was command, commanded. Amen. And the children of Israel saw the face of Moses, that the skin of Moses' face shone. And Moses put the veil upon his face again, amen. until he went into the, to speak with him. Amen. 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 If you would, I, I know you know it. Help me sing the song. Um, not a prolific singer like Bishop Wright, but the song is on my heart tonight. Amen. And don't be nervous. We promise we won't be long before you. 
Lord, we give you glory. We thank you for your love. We thank you for your mercy. Your loving kindness, Lord, is better than life. Kosha. Had it not been for the Lord that was on our side. Father, through every valley that we have come through, we want to say thank you. I'm going. 